Hey everyone, it's Elaine, and here I am with another design team project from Sweet Pea Curiosities. Yep, I'm hooked. She does the best digitals to me. Now this one is all about angels. Um, I will put the link down below where you can find this file folder journal. Um, I used washi tape from um, 49 and Market. And I did put a little bit of glue on it to help hold it in place. Because you know how washi tape will do you. It'll turn loose later. So this one, I don't know. I can't, I can't begin to tell you, to me, how beautiful the graphics are on this digital kit. Um, I'm also at a place recently where... There's been some difficulties and me putting this journal together was actually very therapeutic to me. Um, and you'll see what I mean. Um, they're beautiful and it really makes you think about the world in which we live. I don't know. I'm getting sappy here, I guess. Um, but anyhow, I'm going to do a, a quick flip through as I usually do and show you the graphics that came in this kit. Now, I'm also going to preface this by saying that when I do these, I don't really add a whole lot to them other than what came with them. But this time, there is a little something of my own that I'm going to add, and I'll show you here in a moment. So let's go ahead and start. Again, it's a hinge journal with the washi tape, and there are plenty of pockets in this one. Um, some of them don't have things in it. I didn't worry about it, and I'll tell you why. Because I think that you can do a whole lot with this journal. Now, I did add a little bit of scrap lace here and there. And again, I don't normally do that. Um, but I don't know. I was at a retreat, and I was playing, and... That's, I just added some scrap. Now what I wanted to show you was the smaller pages, unlike the last time I did one of these, this I did leave as a pocket. And the reason why, this is what I want to show you. I took some of my coffee stained paper and I made some, do I say prayer cards? Um, places to write down prayers for others, prayers for myself. Um, and I thought that they would be a good thing to put inside of these pockets. Now, the way I did them, they're probably too big. Oh, just almost. But I figured you could fold them, you could write your prayers, and then these little pockets here would be a good place to put your prayers. Um, I will say that I print on the presentation paper like Marissa, who's the digital artist here, like she suggests. And when I show these to people, they cannot believe that a regular old inkjet printer printed these. That's how beautiful they are in person. And uh, I'm sorry about my grubby hands. Been into stuff today. Um... But they are beautiful. The digitals are beautiful. Um, here's a little tag. I added a little piece of lace. And I just, the way it feels, the size of it, I like holding it in my hands. Um, I think this one is going to be very special to me. I mean, really, look at that graphic. I hope your computer can pick up how beautiful it is. And doing the hinge journal is, is easy. And again, here is another pocket. If I didn't mess up and glue it closed, which I hopefully didn't. As you can see, I haven't played in this one. Did I glue that one shut? Lord have mercy on me. I didn't think I did. I'll have to go back and play with it. I don't really think I did. I think it just might be some extra glue. Um, but anyhow... As you can see, I mean, look how pretty. Just look how pretty. Let's see, here we go. Here's a pocket. Um, the graphics, the background paper with the lace design on it. 
I mean, these digitals, come on now. And it is, it's just beautiful to me. Um, she gives you a lot of different designs. And uh, like I said, I just thought it would be a good place. You know, and you could make this up and keep it on your computer and you could make your journaling cards um, or your prayer cards and change it out often um, as, you know, people that you find um, need prayer requests. And this would be a sincere way for you to do it, not in a gossipy way, not in, you know, any, it, it just would be between you and God or you and the person that you're praying for and uh, I just they're just I thought this would be a great place to keep them here's a little bit more scrap lace I did and um, here we go with another pocket so and again she she gives you so many different um, angels and they are just I, I can't stop saying how beautiful they are and there's plenty of pockets that you know you can stick things back in you could make your prayer cards a little tinier than I did I just took a piece of paper and put it in quarters um, but this I think this one like I said is going to be special to me um, I do have a friend that's going through a difficult time right now um, I may actually end up making one for her, but shh, don't tell her. So anyhow, that is my Angel um, Hinge Journal using the digitals from Sweet Pea Curiosities. I do love being on her design team. Um, it, it's This one really touched me. I just can't begin to tell you how many ways. Um, so please reach out to me if you have any questions about anything and remember that I do have a Facebook group and page and uh, my own private Facebook. If you're ever interested in attending any of my retreats, I do four here in Georgia with Lori. Um, we're called Crafting and Chatting with Lori and Elaine and um, I also do two junk journal retreats and uh, one's coming up pretty soon here. And, uh, you know, I would love to have you. They are focused on junk journaling and mixed media. However, anyone can attend. We do have some activities where you get to show how creative you are. And uh, you learn from some great gals. We play and chat. And no stress, I promise you. And uh, then I also do have a small Etsy shop. And I've been getting a little bit better with my Instagram and then I have Twitter and Pinterest. So I would love for you to follow me on any of those and say hi. But the um, main thing right now is I'm doing things on the design team for Sweet Pea Curiosities. And then I have the six retreats that I'm involved in. And believe me, they keep me busy preparing and getting ready. So again, like I said, if you have any questions or you want to chat, please reach out to me. I will be available. And uh, I will catch you going down the road. Thanks for coming by. See you next time. Bye.